Lily Zhang. American table tennis player Lily Ann Zhang was born June 16, 1996. She is a talented player and has won the women's singles national title in the United States five times. In today's video, we'll be going through Lily Zhang's history and all her achievements. Before we begin, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Now, let us get right into it. Lily Zhang was born to Chinese parents on June 16, 1996 in Redwood City, California. Her father was a professor of mathematics at Stanford. Thus, the whole family lived there. As a child whose parents grew up in Tian, China, they cherished a family tradition of playing table tennis together. Lily's mother was a member of the provincial table tennis team in Xi'an, China and the family often played the game together as a hobby. Her father's table tennis acquaintance and co-worker, Dennis Davis, often took her to the Palo Alto Table Tennis Club so she could hone her skills. Lily received her diploma from Palo Alto High in 2014 and is now a student at the University of California, Berkeley. Lily skipped her sophomore year to focus on Olympic preparations for 2016. She spent some of her gap year playing league and training in Austria. However, she had been competing professionally long before that. Skills that Lily displayed were astounding. Dennis Davis, president and head coach of the Palo Alto Table Tennis Club and representative for North America on the Youth Commission of the International Table Tennis Federation, started teaching her when she was seven years old. Lily was selected to the U.S. cadet team when she was only 11 years old. When Lily was 12 years old, she made history by being the youngest player to ever join the U.S. women's team. By the time she was 13, she had risen to number two on the national rankings for junior women's table tennis players in the United States. Lily won the junior girls event and placed second in the women's singles competition in the 2010 and 2011 U.S. National Championships, respectively. She defeated the previous champion Ariel Singh in seven games to claim her first women's singles national title in 2012. Lily competed as an individual and for the U.S. national team at the 2011 Pan American Games. Lily and his fellow American team members, Ariel Singh and Erica Wu, won bronze as a unit. As a woman, she also triumphed in the singles competition when she took home bronze. Lily, along with Anna Tikomarova of Russia, won the Qatar Peace and Sport Cup Women's Doubles Championship on November 22, 2011. Lily Zhang, the youngest player in the table tennis tournament and the second seed behind teammate Ariel Singh, qualified for the last single spot on the 2012 United States Olympic team after defeating Canada's Anki Liu in five games at the North American Olympic Trials. Zhang lost her first round match against the experienced Croat Cornelia Molnar in straight games. In the first round of the team tournament, the United States faced up against the second-seeded Japanese squad. Zhang was defeated in straight sets by Sayaka Hirano, and then she and Erika Wu lost the doubles match in the same manner against Kasumi Ishikawa and A. Fukuhara. Despite her few failures throughout 2012, 2014, 2016, 2017, and 2019, Zhang has dominated the U.S. National Championship. At the 2011 Pan American Games, she earned bronze medals in both the women's singles and women's team competitions, and she also won the women's doubles competition at the Kedar Peace and Sport Cup. Currently, she is competing for the USA on the women's national team. She has reached as high as number two in the global rankings for cadets, which is under 17, and number five for juniors, which is under 18. Currently, she's only 23 years old and has already taken part in three Olympics games, and the fourth one might just be right around the corner because the next Olympic Games are being held in Paris in 2024. That's all for today's video and thanks for watching it. If you liked it, make sure you give it thumbs up and share it with your friends, and while you are here, click to watch one of these two videos appearing on your screen right now. We will see you there.